Hello and welcome to My Support Solutions YouTube channel. In this video session, we will learn how to create a value contract in SAP with item category W that is material group. But before we start, if you have not yet subscribed to our My Support Solutions YouTube channel, then click on the subscribe button, click on the bell icon and select all notifications to get the latest and free updates after every new video upload. If you like our video, then please click on the like button, also share our videos. Now we we'll start our topic. So first we'll take example and then we'll do practical. Our company is ABC Limited. We have one plant 1000. This is our plant code. We have one vendor 1000. This is our vendor code. With our vendor 1000, we have created a value contract for our desktop and laptop maintenance in our office for 5000 EUR. This is a total contract value. This maintenance contract includes repair as well as replacement of the defective spare parts for desktop and laptop. Price or the value of the spare parts depend on the particular product. Means for example, the price of AGB DDR4 RAM for desktop is 60 EUR. For a mouse, it can be a 12 EUR. For motherboard, it can be 110 EUR, etc. This is only for example. But the total contract value is 5000 EUR. Now, in our practical session, we will do first step create value contract by using transaction code ME31K. Total value for the contract is 5000 EUR. We can also observe the below screenshot that agreement type is WK, means value contract. In item category, we have select W. W stands for material group. We have select material group 00215 for desktop for desktop spare parts and this contract for desktop or laptop maintenance contract with our vendor 1000. Now with this value contract we will create one purchase order by using transaction code ME21N. In this purchase order we will add the the material codes which we require to be replaced. Let us say in our office we found three desktop pieces as damage or not working condition and our uh, engineers found that we need to replace these pieces, these three spare parts from our desktop. Hence we have already created material masters for all these things. Okay, so we will create a purchase order and finally we will check the release documentation statistics that is for uh, the specific contract, for specific value contract and the value of this purchase order will be adjusted against the total value of the contract. Okay, so now we will do practical session and first we will create a value contract by using transaction code ME31K. So, we will give transaction code ME31K, press enter. Our vendor is 1000. Agreement type. Agreement type is WK, that is value contract. Purchase organization 1000, purchasing group is 100. Enter. Validity end date. Validity start is today's date. We will give end date as let us say 31st 12 We'll change the language as English EN. And this is a value for here we will give 5000 EUR. You can refer to our example. Okay. Enter. In item category, select. W that is material group short text desktop or laptop maintenance contract material group we have select item category W here we will select our material group as 00215 for desktop hardware
and plant will select one third. Okay, now we will save our value contract with the vendor 1000. Value contract created under number 460070. Now, with this reference to this contract, we will create a purchase order. Okay. Slash N M E twenty one N enter create purchase order and with reference to this value contract four six. Let us say um, we need to replace the three pieces, three spare parts for our PC. Hence, we will add the three material line items while creating the purchase order okay we will add this this three line items for our outline agreement number and one by one we will add the required material uh, let's say 1558 ram desktop we need to replace one ram for our desktop PC 1560 this is a keyboard and the respective price system has taken the price from our earlier contract created now 1561 motherboard desktop means our engineers has found these three spare parts as a defective in our uh, system in our desktop PC and hence it, it uh, needs to be replaced and because of that we have added these three material codes in our purchase order okay we will deactivate this ERS is not required uh, one by one ERS Click on the shake button. Save. Standard purchase order created and number 45001727. Now last step, we will observe the statistics for this purchase order slash n me 33k display contract enter select the line item first and header item statistics release documentation and this is our purchase order purchasing document which we have created so our contract is for 5000 EUR and out of this we have utilized or we have created purchasing document for 186 EUR and this is the detail okay quantity net value currency document number etc so this is how we can create a value contract by using item category as a W because there is a difference in prices prices are different for each spare parts so that's all for now in this video thank you for watching keep in touch and bye bye